so my name is Benoit Chavez and um, uh, I grew up in uh, Germany. I'm originally from Germany. And my parents are from Angola. Can you hear me now? Yeah. yeah. Um, so, <laughs> so um, my, I, I don't know. Yeah, that's fine. Um, so yeah, um, when, when I came to London, I was really excited. You know, I came to London five years ago and uh, it was exciting because um, where I'm from, there weren't many black people, for example. So I was really happy that I get to see uh, black people in the UK, in the mainstream, mainstream industry, uh, doing positive things. Now, someone here just said that gang culture is mainly a problem in the black community. I've seen that it's not just in the black community. It's a problem in the Asian community. It's a problem in the white community. It's a problem in every community. Quite frankly, we are a human family. And I believe that we all have the obligation to uh, love and learn and understand each other. A couple of weeks ago, someone that I know got killed. And um, he's not the only person that I know who um, has died as a consequence of um, gang crime and violence. I want, I want you all just to close your eyes for a second so that we can share a moment for them and for everyone that has been killed as a consequence of gang crime and violence. If you can all close your eyes for a second. This moment here that we just shared right now is a moment for all eternity. It's a moment that we shouldn't have shared, but we did. I hope that we don't have to share these kind of moments again. Because when you leave this room, you all have an obligation. You all have an obligation to support the young people that you see out there. To care, whether that is with your time, with your money. However you can support, you can make a big difference because a child out there that you see could be a person that will help you tomorrow. And from my research, I've, uh, I've managed to understand a lot and um, I've seen a lot through working with gangs and um, I've seen that it's, 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 it's a mindset. So it's, it's a mindset and we, need to, and we need to educate the parents. We need to make sure that parents know really what is going on in gangs and that they understand what the influences are, they understand what the consequences are. Um, but in order to do that, we need to get um, parents to um, not only associate with programs that the government is giving, but they also need to understand the culture that the young people live in. They need to understand the music, they need to understand the dress code. Parents need to ha create plans with their children so that they can work towards stuff. They need to make sure that their children learn patience, because when a child um, sees uh, parent night trainers, he wants to have it now. We need to make uh, children, uh, we need to impose a mindset on children that th there, is, there is value in patience, that it is worth being patient. We need to teach our children that, speaking in the black community, that we escaped the war and hunger. We need to teach our, our children that they are the future, that they um, have the, all the possibilities in the universe to make a big difference. But it can only work if everyone does their part on a daily basis. It can only work if each and every one of us believes and each and every day we look back and we recognize the path that we've came from, the, the, the tyranny that we've escaped, whether that be in a black community, whether that be in a white community, and whether that be in any community. All of us have seen in the past many things and our world is suffering a lot and it takes all of us to do our part as I just said and this is why I've done my part um, I've written a theatre play I've written a feature film and I've produced this documentary with um, Rafaela Kuznick who's uh, one of the most amazing people I've met on this planet and um, yeah I'm really nervous today because I've never showcased any of my work you know and um, I really hope that uh, you, everyone is going to like this and appreciate it and you can learn something from this and pass it on to someone that you meet in life because each and every one of you, can, can you all look at each other for a second please? Yeah, Look at each other. 
Né? <laughs> Each and every one of you, look at each other. You all are special. You all are very special individuals. And you'll be surprised just by smiling at someone, just by uh, shaking someone's hand, just by complimenting someone, how uh, big a difference you can make in someone's life. So that's my message for you guys today.